Hi, this is Brad with Copper Creek Cuts, a lawn care company in Northeast Florida. And today I'm gonna to show you a new product I've been itching to for a while. I'm very excited about it. Actually, I'm so excited I might've forgotten to hit record. No, I did. <laughs> You've seen some teasers of it before. It's the Elephant's Trunk 2 by GTM. They are, if I'm not mistaken, a German company and they sent me this product by way of a Canadian distributor. So, merci beaucoup pour Das Heckenschnitt Maschine? No, the neighbors are looking at me like I'm crazy. Oh gosh. Anyways, if uh, my Google Translate did me right, that should have been thank you very much in French for the hedge trimming machine in German. But you uh, French and German folks can let me know how far off I was. Now I feel a lot more self-conscious filming this in the neighborhood. Anyways, it's a harness that holds your hedge trimmer or your pole saw or your string trimmer, uh, you know, any kind of stick equipment that you're gonna be using, even your regular handheld hedge trimmers, the idea is that you've got this carabiner that's attached to a string. This string is on a weighted system, so it coils back up. It holds, I think it was three and a half kilograms, and is a kilogram to two, two point two pounds. So seven, eight or eight, somewhere between eight and nine pounds maybe of, of tension is what it holds. Comes in this little carry bag. So we'll get that out. It's got a ton of harnesses and adjustment settings for, for whatever size you are. It is something that it takes a, a couple of uses to get everything dialed in. I can already tell you that some of the comments on here are gonna say this is lazy. I see it all the time for any kind of device that's mainly meant to save labor. People just say, oh, that's lazy. You just need to do it the normal way. You're just lazy. You want an easy way out. And I could be wrong. This is just my opinion. But I think that most of the people who make those kind of comments fall into a couple of broad groups. And again, this is just my opinion, so don't get mad at me for it. But I think that some of them are gonna be younger people who maybe don't have any type of physical issues or physical limitations or they've never injured themselves doing this kind of work. Homeowners, so people who don't do this uh, very often or who don't do it as consistently as, as commercial people, they haven't experienced how much it can you know, beat up your body. And then, I mean, there are some people who go all through life without ever hurting themselves. I would love to have that happen to me, but I've, ar I've already got some shoulder issue developing. I did a job where I had to hold a pole saw like this for a few hours, trimming crepe myrtles. It popped something that had already been giving me trouble for a few years, and so now I've got pretty constant pain in my shoulder here. So when I saw this, I was like, wow, this is, this is great. This is exactly what I need. Thankfully, they sent it to me to try out. It's a very neat product that's gonna save a lot of wear and tear on your body. And if you're doing a lot of hedges, it's gonna save you time too, because you're gonna be able to work at a higher level for longer rather than beating yourself up for a few hours. And I think that anyone who has done uh, hedge work or even hedge trimmer work, you know, for several hours, you can kind of see the benefit of something like this. And I'm telling you, I, I love it. I've used it twice on the first job was a several hour job and it makes such a difference. It does take some getting used to, but there's nothing bad to say about it. It's just that, you know, you have to get used to this, this way of work. So you can see here how it sits on me. And again, there's all kind of adjustments everywhere to really dial in. It can get hung up in tree branches. So, you know, you just have to be mindful of that. That's really the only negative that I found, which Again, I wouldn't even call it a negative. It's just a fact of life, right? That's just what's going to happen when you have something real tall.
right, so there you go. There's your first look at the GTM Professional ET2 or Elephant's Trunk 2. I really, really, really like it. If you'd like to see more in action, stay tuned for that. If you've got any questions about this tool, please let me know, put them down in the comments. I'm still trying to talk to the distributor, see if somebody in the States is interested, what the best way is. They do have uh, a website and that'll be in the description if you're interested, but it is Canadian. So, you know, it's Canadian dollars and it ships from Canada, which I don't think is an issue, but I just don't know if there's an easier way for uh, people in the States to get it. But I'll follow up with that as well. So any questions, leave them below. I'll get an answer for you. If you'd like to see some more videos, here's a few YouTube things you might like. Please subscribe and click the notification bell, especially if you wanna see updates on this tool or more uses of it, because otherwise YouTube won't let you know when I put out new videos. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it.